I'm going to do an exercise for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you are new to Siamese Mahjong, there is a link to a demonstration and there's a link to the rules because they've been modified for a two-player game. Two players playing two hands at one time. It's very challenging and a lot of fun. And you can play online now at SiamesMahjong.com. I'm going to do three sprints. My goal is to make decisions in under two minutes. If you are new to this version, give yourself three or four minutes and then push yourself to get to that two minute mark. Once you get to the two minute mark, you could even play online without the game tossing a towel for you because it's timed. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. I have my smartphone here with a stopwatch app. We'll do five laps. Laps one, three, and five will be the sprints. Laps two and four will be set up. I'll roll these dice to determine if we're player one or player two. Odd will be player one, even will be player two. I rolled an even. So we're going to be player two. I will get 27 tiles. Okay, jokers, flowers, south green, lots of cracks. Two, five, eight pairs. Here we have dots with a pair of sevens, bams, singles. With these tiles, let's see, one, two, four, five, five through nine, five through nine, one, two. I think I might do maybe a year hand. Whoopsies. A year hand and five through nine. Oops. Okay. I think this is how I would do it. Not sure about that one yet. Okay. Five through nine, first hand. We could use these to help with these tiles in here. We need to pung, kong, pung. Really, we could use these here because this is ready to pung. Use this for joker bait. Down here, play a year hand. Let's see. Two, one, nine. We have a pair of twos. We really don't need that. We could maybe, though, play 2-3. I think I would hold that just to see. But if we played 2019 with flowers, we would need to do it like this. Flowers, 2019, 1-9. But I would hold all these because when I play in a category, I keep all the tiles for that category. And then when I run out of discards, I whittle down. Because year tiles this year, one, two, we might be able to use threes and switch to consecutive runs. So that's why I would hold that. So I would do five through nine, joker bait, year tiles. Maybe the first hand. Or we could switch to one, two, three Kongs in one suit. We probably have, let's say, eight discards with Joker bait, which is not too bad. For the next sprint, we're going to be 
player one, since I rolled an odd number, the jokers are ones. We'll get 28 tiles. Wow, look at these bams and dots. We have cracks, three or a pair of sixes. We have one through five, pung, pair, seven, eight. Here we have a flower, a dragon. Then we have one, two, three, four, six, seven. We've got one, two, three pair in there. So here I would leverage the multiples, of course. We could play one through five. One through five, maybe. Let's see here. We do one through five. One through five consecutive run. No gaps. Three, four, maybe three, four with the dragon. One, two, three, let's see, three, six. One, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, three, four. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Then down here, maybe three, six, nine. Three, six, nine. Three, six, nine. Pair hand. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Let's see. Okay, lap. Ooh, I don't know about this one. Let's see. Three, six, nine, pair hand. One, two, three, four. Consecutive number two. Pung, Kong, Pung, Kong. I think I would hold these tiles though, because we could do one through five consecutive run. We could use this up here for three, four with dragons, so I would hold this too. But I would see about maybe playing the 369 pair hand down here. That would be the fifth hand down under singles and pairs. And then use this for joker bait up here. Because we can't use joker bait here for playing a pair hand. The joker bait would go here to help us with this hand. So we have consecutive run either the first hand the third hand down or the second hand down. So I would discard these first. Let me know what you think about that. Online I see a lot of people playing at least one pair hand. One pair hand because it's all about total value at the end because you compare the total score. So if you have one big hand you could take the game, even if you win only that big hand. Big hand, little hand, could take the game. This right here could be a winner. We just need a two and a four, and that'll be set and even potentially pure. Maybe. It's a nice thought. I don't know. Because this needs to be a Kong, and this needs to be a Kong. But we could Pung this right here. Okay, next one. We are going to be player two. I will get 27 tiles.
Whoops, forgot to lap. Look at these winds and dragons. Oh my goodness, that's crazy. Wow. Oh my goodness. Okay, news dragons. News and dragons. East and west with dragons. East and west with dragons. Or the news pair hand. Let's see. News. News. Not the news pair hand. News concealed. Dragons. Oh my goodness, look at those dragons. We don't have enough cracks to do a pair hand, I don't think. Four or five, and we don't have four or five. Yeah, I don't think I would do that. But what I would consider would be maybe a year hand with dragons. So news with six, six. Okay, lap. I think this is what I would do. Keep that. This is what I would do. I would play maybe a year hand with dragons. This would be the third hand down. And then up here we could play news with sixes. Or we could even maybe instead play a quint using these tiles and then play up here north and south with dragons. So it's kind of interchangeable for now. I would gather And discard those when those are gone then I would get I would make a decision so I would gather wins sixes year tiles and see what happens but if I had to pick a hand right now I would play year hand with dragons and news with sixes pair hand so that's eight discards with this plan eight discards with joker bait which we would need here because can't use jokers with a pair hand. Let's see how things went with the time. When you play Siamese Mahjong online, you have two minutes to figure out what to do with all those tiles after the deal. If you are not quick enough, the game will discard for you. Or if your opponent discards early, it could catch you off guard. So train yourself to make quick decisions under two minutes if you can. Let's see how I did with timing. Sprint one, one minute 38. Sprint two, uh oh, two minutes 25. The game would have tossed a tile for me on that one. Sprint three, one minute 42. So that second sprint, I would have lost a tile. One thing you could do is just quickly figure out what to focus on and identify just a couple discards and discard if you're the dealer. Because then that takes the pressure off of you and you can figure out what your plan is after you discard because if you do not arrange your tiles the game might toss a tile that you could be considering for one of your hands so if you can quickly identify your initial discards and then figure the rest out later you might be safe i probably could have done that with that second sprint when i went over figure out what my discards were discard if i'm the dealer real quick and then finish planning because then your opponent needs time to figure out what they're going to do as well. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. 
click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next Sign Me Sprints using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.